Hello guys and welcome back. This is Mr. A and I'm bringing you another RT, RTW battle. This was a 30k um, team battle so it was a 10k each. It was CD, C, uh, CWB rules and what you will see is nothing short of a miracle. Um, I can't believe that um, you know I did this or whatever so Obviously you've got me, Mr. A, as the Brutii. You've got um, a Dosa, a Dosa 3194. He actually leaves pretty soon. Um, over there I have the I have Gussie. And then my opponents, and he is Egypt and um Aldosa. Aldosa sir, um is Macedon. And then over there we've got um, Jordan. Uh, my good friend Jordan, he's the Julii. Here we have um, W Fallon 59. He is the Greek city states, and then over here, facing me is Heinrich Mailer. I think it's supposed to be, and he is the Seleucids. Now I love facing the Seleucids because I'm so used to facing them. Um, because well, Bubo is usually the Seleucids, and um, I've become pretty good at going against them, so um, yeah. So what we've got here, we've got uh, these. We've got some militia cav here. We've got some uh, generals, bodyguard, more militia cav, more militia cav, and just militia cav. And then over here, we've got some archers. Now you can tell that this guy's pretty new. Um, this guy's charged into my cavalry with some militia cav and an armored general, I think it is, or a general's bodyguard. So I've just got two infantry units over here facing these these guys over here. So um, it'll be interesting to see what happens over here. And then once we go over here, uh, my Macedonian guy, um, I think he has left already. I th yes, I think he's left. So he actually left pretty much straight away. So you've got me over here. I've just completely surrounded those that general unit and the... Um, other units that were over there. So you've got my units here um, firing in at these um, silver shield pikemen and we've got some phalanx pikemen as well I think here. So um, I'm doing pretty well over here. This guy as I say, so you can tell it's now the computer because like the units are going everywhere. Um, so basically now it's a 3v2 uh, because the computer is stupid. And um, Egypt is getting completely and utterly battered um, over here and what you will see is Egypt get mauled to death um, and Jordan's doing really well he's firing at these Egyptian um, chariots which is a really good idea try and get them to run amok and he's just going to rip apart these guys over here so let's go back to my side of the battle so what has happened is I have com pretty much completely surrounded the um, uh, Seleucids over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to strike them from the flank and then we're going to see a nice big chain route. So there we go. There goes the Seleucids um, and I'm firing in a lot of flame arrows as well so it's just lowering the morale. I've got my general in Testudo but only, the only reason I had my general in Testudo because they were all facing him um, and they were obviously all walking yeah, forward towards him. Swing. And now his men fear us. So um, now I've taken him out, put, get, got him straight in there, and um, that's pretty much the end of the Seleucid player. He's still got some archers over here, um, but that's pretty much it of the Seleucid player. And um, so I'm just mopping up now over here. Um, uh, Egypt has got completely and utterly battered by um, Jordan over here. He's done really well. Um, I didn't really want to go into the Nile Spearman with his cavalry. Um, but that's okay. So as you can see what I'm doing, I'm trying to reform all my troops over here and slowly starting to walk towards um, Greece and um, and uh, Jordan over here so so currently now it is a 3v1 because as I say 
or a 2v1 because uh, this Macedon is just a computer and if um, this player here actually turned around he could have kicked the crap out of this player um, because his guys were upgraded plus it was the computer after all and then um, if it have done whatever I'm sure Jordan would have brought over some troops just to give him a bit of a hand but luckily it's given me a little bit of extra time to get over here um, I did start walking but I decided that I needed to run I'm not sure if it's going to be at any time soon where is it, where is it, where is it yeah so as I, as I say you can you can tell this is the computer because um, it's going off the stupid units but look at all this look at all this dead all these dead Seleucids my man randomly stabbing no one killing the dead men so here comes uh, Jordan coming over trying to give a bit of support to his um, ally over here which is um, good teamwork uh, he needs to bring the, his guys back out as quick as possible don't run into them don't run into them don't, don't, don't no I think it was because he was trying to get these um, these units over here and he just didn't realize that these guys were doing that um, he shouldn't have gone into the flanks of these um, pikemen he should have taken out all these guys here um, but as you can see I'm still just wandering over but um, he's still got quite a lot of his um, urban cohorts left he's still got quite a lot of um, his Roman archers left um, what um, this player needs to be doing is he needs to be firing into these guys here don't worry about the um, the archers I'd be firing into here for one reason and one reason only to lower their morale because his guys are upgraded quite well um, and these uh, Macedonians weren't really that much up that, that badly upgraded plus these are armored hoplites these guys don't have much much for shield so I'll be shooting at these guys just free up an extra unit so there's me I'm coming in to charge against this um, this unit here uh, didn't actually do that much damage to be honest um, but here I'm, I'm slowly coming over with my um, archers and things like that so as you can see I'm going after these um, Greek cities I'm not quite sure why I charged right into that because I'm, off, I'm going against the Greeks Never mind. Yeah, so I'm going up against the Greeks. I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, it's probably because I was trying to micro everything else. I'm trying to micro this. I'm trying to micro all my archers, my um, my urbans and things like that. I've still got a cavalry unit over here. So, yeah. So I'm right now. I'm trying to face um, Jordan at the moment, thinking he's the biggest threat because uh, we've got these um, armoured generals over here, armoured um, armored hotlights over here, so I'm just trying to fire in and try and lower their morale at the moment. Uh, but I still have um, a good bit of cavalry up here, plus over here I've got a few. So, um, But constantly I'm getting fired upon. So as you can see, the computer was not much help to me. Um, they took down some of these um, armored hot blights, but look, there's still the three units left. Four units, you know. Plus, I've got to face um, all these urban cohorts as well. So I have to take on two armies now because this um, Egypt player doesn't actually do anything. So I've got to bring back all my um, all my cavalry units. Basically, what I'm trying to do right now. It's fire into all these units here. I'm trying to get all my cavalry, all my infantry over as well, so I can um, surround them. Uh, but Jordan really should have run over here as quick as he could, but 
what he's trying to do is he's trying to mop up so that he doesn't get surrounded which is a really good idea so here I come I'm trying to go into the flank of something I sh probably shouldn't have charged in now probably lost quite a lot of um, cavalry units there I'm just trying to completely surround them so there's no way out um, but while they're uh, turned around fighting my um, my units over there what am I doing? I must have tried to reform maybe because I was looking at these so we've got some Illyrians here and there we go we've finally broke them so there I've, I faced one army two armies and now I've got to face Jordan's army and um, he's got far more infantry, far more cavalry at the moment. Um, but just by shooting fire arrows at these two units here I've made them break. Um, so I'm just going to keep on firing at them to try and um, whittle them down as much as possible. Um, but as you can see 29, 23 uh, do I have any more? I have another one, 24 here as well. So, uh, but he's definitely got the um, infantry advantage. He's got four units, four urban cohort units. I've got three, but I do have a lot of archers still. Whereas his general is stuck over here facing these um, raw pikemen plus some pharaoh's bowmen. And um, my, one, uh, my ally is bringing over some. Uh, Nile Heavy Cavalry. Uh, he's done a really good job here with bringing his general out. Maybe what he should have done is waited. Now he's charged straight into the middle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and surround um, his units. I'm going to bring all my cavalry back from wherever they were. I'm going to constantly keep firing in flame arrows. Just try and shoot these guys as much as possible. I thought this was lost here because look at the amount of... Um, infantry there is here compared to mine. Mine's really thin in the middle in the middle. Mine's really thin here. Really um, should be chucking these in. I'm trying to surround but he's seen that I'm trying to surround him and he's just um, brought out a few units which has stopped my charge. So what you're gonna see is a lot of running around in this um, in this battle. A heck of a lot of running around. What I should have done is turn these guys straight around here. As you can see, right here, I should have turned them around. Uh, but he's got this unit facing towards the um, uh, facing towards me. He's broke this unit, fleeing in panic, fleeing in panic, and obvious to the world, and oblivious to the world. Sorry. So as you can see, I've got two units now, two units of infantry. I've got 52 in that one, and I've got 38 in that one. Uh, we've broke this unit here of urban cohorts, but he still has uh, one, two, three, four units of urban cohorts still left. Um, and there goes another unit. It's because I'm using all these fire arrows. The enemy general is slain. Um, so basically all I've done is put my infantry attack. in... Uh, Testudo and I just wanted to fire at them with all these arrows here uh, I'm quite happy for these guys to be firing at me with normal arrows. I'm, I'm not I'm, I'm not Bothered whatsoever with that as you can see I've broken another unit um, What I need to be doing is go for this going for this general unit um, But they're firing at these archers which probably isn't the best idea Um We've got this unit over here that's um, shaken. I'm pretty much just doing feints. I'm trying to get these units to just move away. Um, so that while they're moving they're going to get cut down. So we've just um, destroyed um, Julii. Uh, I've still got not a bad portion of my army left. Basically all it is now is just running around the battlefield. So um, I'm just going to fast forward it. As you can see, I've still got a lot of my cavalry left. Can I do it that one? Yeah, that's still going. But as I say, it's just going to be me basically running around the, um, the battlefield now, trying to 
kill these archers. I believe there's an archer unit somewhere else. Where is it? No. Yeah, so as I say, it's basically just going to be me running around trying to kill archers. I think. I think there is another one down here somewhere. There you go. There's one archer unit there as well that we've got to go for. Um, but I basically had to take on, well I took on Jordan's army uh, with a little bit of help from Egypt um, because the Pharaoh's bowmen are actually pretty good. Yeah, so what I need to do is I need to come back here with some uh, cavalry just to chase these guys down. Um, but um, my ally here has still got quite a few troops over here, still got loads of Pharaoh's bowmen, I would have thought they'd still have um, ammo left, I'm sure they could have shot at these guys so um, <laughs> I've got a Roman archer unit over here as well come on, go and get it there we go I just realised that there was a unit over here so um, I'm just starting to chase after it now. I think I actually shoot it to death. Or do I? No. Must have been these Illyrians. Illyrians and Peltasts. So, um, but it was a really good game. I did think I'd lose it. He did have, uh, Jordan did have a lot more infantry than me. Um, but I had a little bit more cav left. And my micro was slightly better than his, but... Um, that, that that will just come with time. As I say he's he's still pretty new, um, especially to online gaming. Uh, for this game, it's a lot more difficult than people think it is. So, and here comes some uh, chariots. Come on, kill them for God's sake. Slowly shooting at them. There you go, there's a few more. Oh, what? There must be another one. Where's the, where's the other unit then? I can't even remember. Where do you think, guys? One over here? must be another unit somewhere what? oh let's just look at the dead let's just go through the dead look at all that poor old Seleucids um, but as I say in 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 this I really really shouldn't have um, used my cav the way I did especially against the um, the Greeks um, it was a bit of a stupid idea to charge directly into the Greeks. Um, I don't quite understand why I actually charged straight into the Greeks, but, um, you know, there must be something somewhere, surely. Everyone's coming up here. Okay. I must see something at some point because I think I'll send my cavalry after it. But yeah. Um, yeah, so I've, I've pretty much got most of my archers intact. I've got an archer up there. I've still got uh, these urban cohorts at 40 and 33. I did lose my other, my other cohorts. So here we are. Um, I deployed 863 men and killed 1,977 with 517 men remaining. Um, also, Jordan did really well. He killed 1,064. Most of them was the um, Egyptians, which he did really well on. And um, yeah, well done to Jordan for taking on the Egyptians. Um, the Seleucids killed 162, which was mine, I think. I don't think he killed anyone else. But 
Well played to everyone. Um, well played to Jordan. And well played to my team, even though this guy left within like two minutes of actually playing. So it was a 3v2. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you all later.